Wait, what? What's up guys, it's me Janet and I'm back with another video. Today, we are getting intimate. We are in my bathroom. I'm in my sports bra and my shorts and it's time for us to get ready because I am going on date night. This is my excitement. We are going on date night tonight with my boyfriend Thomas. So I've already taken a shower this morning. I've already done my skincare this morning. It's still the morning. No way, it's not. Is it? No. It's almost 3 in the afternoon. Right now, my face is looking like this. If you guys look real close, you can enjoy the view of my lashes. That is looking really... <laughs> oh god, that looks very sad. Uh, yeah, basically my lashes look insane. Okay, I'm gonna start off by comb... Oh. What the heck? <laughs> I'm gonna start off by combing my lashes because it's looking a little bit crazy. You know what guys? I don't even know if I did my intro properly just now but hi, what's up? If you guys are new to my channel, my name is Janet. I make fashion lifestyle videos, flight attendant videos because I'm a flight attendant and I make whatever the heck I feel like posting is what I post. Also, I've been posting like three times a week so subscribe, click the notification bell. First thing first, I'm gonna put on my foundation because I don't use concealer. Um, I used to and then I didn't see the point in it anymore. I'm just gonna squirt this over. The foundation that I use by the way is this um, little Fenty Beauty foundation in the shade 460. You know every single time I put on foundation on my face, I'm always like, okay, so this is not my shade. This is a shade darker, a couple shades darker. Yeah, because for those of you who are new to my channel, I like wearing foundations darker than my skin because I think it gives me a flawless finish. It makes me look pretty. I mean, not as dark as like, I'm just gonna look like crazy, like my face different under my body but like because I'm black I can get away with it very easily so slightly darker than my skin basically it's not that noticeable okay maybe a little bit noticeable but right now since I don't know if you guys know this but I just came back from vacation with my man if you guys are subscribed you would know that I just came back from vacation with my man in Vietnam we were in the Vietnam I, I keep saying islands but it's not Vietnam islands it's basically like Hoi An and Nha Trang and we also went to the city which is Ho Chi Minh and yeah basically I was on the I was on the beach at the beach way too much that I got Tan, real tan and those people who think black people can't tan honey we tan so yeah now my foundation actually suits my skin color so it's good okay so next up is eyebrows time so I'm just gonna comb my eyebrows out and then I'm gonna fill them in and I know that you know what's funny though whenever I make like videos and stuff and there's like a get ready with me process oh I might even focus whenever I make like get ready with me processes and stuff like that after I finish editing my video I usually watch back my videos and to make sure it looks good and I watch it a couple of times so like make sure that I, I'm not bored of it if I don't like my video I won't post it there's so many times where I film videos and I just don't post ah shoot ah I have thick brows so there's so many times where I just I didn't like the way the content look and I just don't post the video because quality over quantity. Yeah, so usually whenever I rewatch my videos, the first time I watch the whole video, but the second time, third time, whenever I rewatch it to see if you'll get bored from watching it again and again, I always keep my makeup portion because I don't know why. I like watching other people get ready, other people doing their makeup, but personally, I don't like watching myself doing my makeup. I don't even know why. The other day, my friend was watching my video and just because I always keep it, I told her, babe, you can just skip past the makeup part, you know, and she was like, no, I actually really like the makeup part. And I was like, huh, really? She's like, yeah, I want to see how you do your eyebrows. By the way, I'm saying this stuff. I'm I'm telling you guys the story because I'm doing my eyebrows right now. So just, it reminded me of that moment. That's when I was like, huh, people actually like watching this stuff. Anyway, yeah, that's the story. That's the great, that's the great story. Do you guys remember when like, uh, what the Nike brows were thing? <laughs> <sighs> good old days in it I'm not gonna lie I'm actually kind of lazy to do my makeup so this is the part where I usually like clean up my brows make it look snatched okay you know what I was gonna skip that but I think I'm gonna do it it's a date night okay the least I could do is look hot for my boyfriend so that's what I'm gonna do I'm going to clean up my brows if I can find anything in this hole this is like a pit hole like a bag pit hole. oh my god you know what it's like it's like a mom's handbag it is like a mom's handbag. My mom's handbag <laughs> goes on to eternity. Literally, you can put it in your hand, just dig around and pull out a plum. Like, and say what a good boy am I. If you guys know that song, he had a lit childhood. Um, but yeah, my mom's bag, you put it in your hand, you can pull out anything. And right now, oh, by the way, I didn't even tell you guys. The eyebrow pencil that I was using, I wish I could tell you guys what it was, but 
this is it this literally this is it and uh, my eyebrows pe eyebrow pencil is gone yeah so i can't really read what it is i don't know what brand that is you know what it reminds me of though it reminds me of you know back in school like when you're in, i don't know about other country okay but in Malaysia is where I grew up. In Malaysia, primary school we have to use pencil and then secondary school is when we use pen. Secondary school is high school. If you guys didn't catch that already. So in primary school when we have to use pencil, we used to like sharpen our pencil till it's like the literally the last bit till it's like this short and we'll still like continue using it. I don't know, the shorter it is, the more fun it is to write. Anyway, right now to conceal my eyebrows, I'm actually using the Sephora um, foundation. <laughs> I'm using a foundation to conceal in the shade um, I can't tell the shade because I feel like I told this in another video before the shade is messed up at the back but it's basically a Sephora foundation that matches my original skin color not my after 10 oh damn it I think I finished it come on baby you can do it mommy's cheering for you just when I thought I want to look hot for my man come on come on okay it's not working oh it came to mommy. We gotta work with what we have in it. This is how much I have. That was very unfocused, but okay. So I'm just gonna clean up my brows. Oh crap, I did it a little bit over. Yeah, and I'm gonna clean up the top. And go down. And then a little bit on this side. And then a little bit on top. Thick brows, she thick or whatever. Okay, perfect. Oh, by the way, <laughs> really off topic, but the other day I was getting ready for work and then I had a, like a pimple on my face here. So I decided, <laughs> don't think I'm stupid, but I decided to cover it with liquid liner and make it look like, just put a dot of liquid liner on top of my pimple and make it look like it's a mole. And I thought it was really cute. So I might try to recreate that look tonight. Not gonna lie, Tom is probably gonna make fun of me. <laughs> with my new mole, he sent me that. Uh, ah, don't know. Damn it! Now I have to wash it. You know what? I need to throw this away. Is what I need to. I need to throw this away and get a new one because it's dirty. So now that we're done with foundation, um, I'm not gonna do much to be honest. I'm just doing like very simple makeup. Uh, I feel like I was talking way too much more than I was doing anything. This second, we are gonna go in with eyes. Um, that's the brand of this eyeshadow. But I'm gonna take this color. I'm not a huge eyeshadow person. Whoa, whoa, honey, focus on me. Okay, I'm not a huge eyeshadow person. So I'm just gonna take this color and put it in the inner corners of my eyes. I feel like I dropped something. I have no idea what it is, but whatever. I'm just gonna put that in the inner corners of my eyes. That's what all the beauty gurus always say. Inner corners, put it in the inner corners. So yeah, that's what's gonna happen. Just to make me look like I'm wide awake. Yeah. Right now, because my eyelashes are messed up, I'm just going to do eye, uh, what's it called, eyeliner so that it covers up the fact that my eyelashes are pretty much looking like a crap. Eyeliner, liquid liner. I don't have a brand because again, okay, I'm like really bad, okay? By the way, I'm not a beauty guru, okay? So, uh, I'm not a beauty guru. So, like, <laughs> the, I can't tell you what brand it is because it's just plain black, literally, like everything is gone. I probably stole it from my sister, I don't even know. Okay, so right now I'm done with makeup. I'm just gonna finish the look with the Kat Von D. Um, liquid lipstick. I don't know what shade it is again. I'm so sorry. Everything is faded. But uh, yeah, basically it's a Kat Von D liquid lipstick in uh, this kind of like brownish color. But right now, I'm not going to do that just yet because I still have things to do before I leave. But um, yeah, so I'm just gonna do my hair real quick. My hair is, I just, as I told you guys, I just took a shower just now. So my hair is like extremely curly and short right now. So I'm thinking, ooh, I actually was going to iron it, but I kind of like the curls. Ooh, should I let it down or should I? Hmm, this is a good one. Ooh, looks kind of cute. <laughs> Look at myself, checking myself out. Anyway, I think, okay, I think I'm just gonna iron a little bit. I'll still give it like volume. I'm not gonna like take it out of volume. I'm gonna leave a little bit of volume, but I think I'm just gonna iron it to give it length because I mean anybody with curly hair can relate to me over here freaking hair curly hair just whoop your length up so I need, to, I need to give it a little bit of length so I'm just gonna I'm gonna leave this to heat up I'm using the hair iron and the brand Anko Anko I bought it in Australia I don't even know if it's an Australian brand but I bought it in Australia oh it's made in China yeah whatever anyway so I'm just gonna leave that to close for a bit and heat up while I take a break, have a Kit Kat, I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay, so the 
iron is already hot. We're gonna start off by sectioning the hair. I'm gonna put this down like this. I'm gonna take like big chunks. You guys can take. By the way, my armpit is wet is because I just put on. Uh, <laughs> it's so disgusting, but I just put on dear trend. I think I put it on this morning, but I forgot. So better safe than sorry. So I'm just putting it on again. Anyway, so um, I'm just gonna comb it out, let it fluff out like this a little bit. The last time I did like a ironing my hair video was like I'm straightening my curling hair to straight hair for the first time in a very long time. I got comments from people telling me that I should dry my hair before actually ironing it. So I'm live and I learned. Thank you guys for that comment and now I did dry my hair because the last time I came out from the shower and I was like wet hair straight ironed it and it basically fried my hair that's what they told me so yeah now I've dried it and I'm ironing it so there's no sound. Uh, so this is what I'm gonna do I'm just gonna clip it hold it pull it and try not to burn my neck. So let's like fast forward this part. Okay, I'm almost done. Just a little bit more. Now you guys, you guys see what I mean by like not trying too hard, but just getting the length. I think this looks super cute. Okay, this is a good decision that I in my hair. I'm gonna take off this. Don't want any hazard. Okay, so I'm just gonna tie up my hair right now to kind of like keep it in the good, you know, the good position like let it be kind of like laid you know like lay my hair because we're actually not leaving the house right now we are leaving you know what oh actually this hair also looks kind of cute depends on what earring i'm wearing why is my camera keep losing focus anyway so i'm gonna leave my hair like this and i'll film my um, outfit portion and putting on my lipstick in a while because we're not actually leaving right now so i'm gonna i'm gonna take a break i'll see you guys when it's time for me to change into the outfit i'll show you guys the final look and i'll also show you guys my final look with the with the lipstick i don't know where i was going with that see you guys in a bit okay so updates time i just got out of a second shower i left my makeup on my face and my hair done i just took a body shower and right now i'm actually picking out my outfit technically not really picking out my outfit because i already know what i'm gonna wear i am going to wear um this cute little leotard which is like this burgundy-ish color and i'm gonna wear it with my i feel like you guys have seen this outfit before i've talked about this amazing combo before Ugh! this one right here my white um skinny jeans from fashion nova both of them are from fashion nova i'm gonna wear that combination because tom has always been telling me i always wear this outfit we are doing long distance by the way if you guys didn't know every single time i wear this outfit he's not here he's in sydney so he's always like you always wear the cute ones when i'm not there so i thought you know what i'm gonna wear it for him so yeah because it's our date night i'm gonna wear this with that i'll put it on and then i'll show you guys the final look okay guys so this is the full outfit and i'm gonna be wearing it with these heels i also think this outfit is so cute by the way just ignore <laughs> that hanging at the back that that's my bed sheet i just did laundry my bed is a mess i just did laundry and yeah so i'm hanging my bed sheet there because it's too big and there's no else to hang it in my house anyway so this is the outfit um i'm gonna be pairing up with these heels i think this outfit looks so cute and finally tom gets to see it i'll show you guys his reaction later or maybe not i don't know um anyway, Anyway, so my mom just came by and he's talking to my mom right now in the hall. I don't know if you guys can hear that. But I'm just going to end the video over here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Wait, let me turn it to me. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys like it, don't forget to give it the usual thumbs up. And if you're feeling extra awesome, don't forget to click the subscribe button below. And turn on my notification bell. Because... It will notify you guys when I upload. I don't know. I've never said that. I don't usually say that in videos. But now I'm saying it. Anyway, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram. I post a lot of cool, lit pictures. And um, my hair looks so flat. I don't even know why. But yeah, my feet is really cool. So yeah, go and follow me. And I love you guys so much. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.